So guys, I didn't plan on getting on here until later on this afternoon or later on this evening, but um, I couldn't shake this word that the Lord wanted me to give to somebody. So the word is do not go on that trip. Do not go on that trip. There's somebody that is planning on doing like um, a weekend getaway, a Labor Day weekend getaway. The person that you're going with, they're not your wife. They're not your husband. I don't know what the scenario is. They may be your boyfriend or your girlfriend, but you are planning on, I don't know if you already booked, if you have, well, actually you have already booked this venue. You're already preparing to go to this weekend getaway, okay, with this man or this woman, the gender, whoever you are is not given to me. But I've been placed here. I've been pulled away from what I was doing to get on here and say, do not take that trip. The Lord has already been speaking to you about this. He's already been dealing with you about having a closer walk with him. So now you are getting ready to take a trip. Okay, there's nothing indicated to me that anything will happen to you. It is nothing like that. I'm not giving anything to say something will go on and something will happen. That is not what the Lord has shown me. All that has been placed in my spirit is to tell whoever you are, son or daughter of God, the person that God has been speaking to you, he has been dealing with you about returning to him, about getting in right standing with him. You have planned a trip for the upcoming weekend, the upcoming holiday that you're going to go away and you're going to be spending time with somebody where you'll be spending You'll be staying overnight, you'll be spending the weekend, and definitely you will be falling into sexual sin. I'm going to extend this word also to whoever you are that you are in an affair. And you may be planning this trip, making up a story already to your spouse or whoever you're seeing there, making up a story to their spouse to spend time with you if you are hearing my voice do not take this trip. This is all the Lord gave me. I pray that you will be obedient. I ask those of you who are listening that this does not apply to you. Please pray for our brothers and sisters in the Lord. All right, guys.